Hey everyone, it's Pegmas. It's been a while since this last video and I thought I'd show you a quick command I found that was pretty cool. It's called the split command. Um, now, a flaw that I have with my printer, uh, admittedly, is that when I try to print something, let's say this D6 dice, um, the bottom here usually doesn't come out too well because that's the part that the surface is built on. And, you know, that makes for an uneven surface and not a very pretty print. So, with the split command, I'm going to just go ahead and just, you know, type it in, hit enter. Um, we can split the thing in whatever halves we want. I mean, it's a cube and therefore it doesn't really matter where we split it as long as it's along one of the normal planes of axis. We're going to go ahead and just choose the, uh, let's do the top plane. And we can pick where it's split. So we're going to go ahead and cut the part. And now it's in two different sections. Right. Then we go over here to the solid bodies, which tells us which solid bodies exist. And we're going to go ahead and just delete this second body. And we're going to hit the green check mark. And now we have what it says, essentially one half of our die. So now when we go to say this is an STL file and print it, this part we can just smooth out with acetone or sandpaper if we felt like it and then print out two halves and glue them together and then we'd have the entire piece that we originally had and that everybody is the most simplest definition of split command if anybody's interested I can make a more complex split video where I try to split let's say a ring um, so if that interests you go ahead and you know, type that in the comment box. If you're liking my videos, please hit that subscribe button. It lets me know I'm doing a pretty good job and encourages me to do more videos. So thanks for watching.